Being the bike guy here at Motor Week, I'm often asked, what's a good first bike for someone that's looking to get into riding? And most aren't too thrilled when I tell them to find a 15 or 20 year old Honda Nighthawk. They want something flashy or something that looks cool, like this Honda CBR250R. This new baby CBR would indeed make a great first motorcycle for anyone. But in actuality, like many recent compact car entries we've been testing here at Motor Week, the 250R was probably designed with an eye more towards the rapidly growing Chinese market than ours. But that's just fine, as all new entry-level bikes are few and far between, with most consisting of a lot of trickle-down parts from larger bikes or repurposed dirt bike parts. But the CBR 250R is indeed all new, and that includes the engine, which is a dual overhead cam, water-cooled, 249cc single. It's also fuel injected, which believe it or not is still relatively unique in the beginner bike ranks and has an internal counterbalancer that makes it surprisingly smooth for a single. Being a 250, obviously power is slight, but this little thumper does have a decent mid-range, so you don't have to fully ring it out to the 10,500 RPM redline between every shift. Spot on fuel injection helps as well. With its full fairing and large silver muffler cover, it definitely gets points for style. Our test bike's red, white, blue, and gold paint scheme makes the 250R look like it was designed for a superhero, and new riders will undoubtedly feel like one, as the 250R is super easy to ride. Old school cable clutch action is very light, gears of the six speed click through perfectly, and weight comes in at only 366 pounds when you opt for Honda's combined ABS. My feeling on ABS is, while obviously a great safety feature for a new rider, learning how to deal with front or rear wheel lockup is an essential component to riding a motorcycle safely, so just keep that in mind. The seat is as comfortable as any standard, though your passenger might feel otherwise, and riding position sporty, but not intimidatingly so, as foot pegs are not mounted too high. Mirrors are sizable and steady, great for new riders, while gauges feature a nice big tack and digital speedometer. There's also a small digital fuel gauge, but no gear indicator, which will be a drawback for rookies. All switch gear and body components have the usual Honda quality feel. The 250R would also make a great commuter, as it runs just fine on regular gas, and you can get 65 miles per gallon without even trying too hard. Pricing at just $4,600 is also great, as most people think it looks like a sport bike that costs twice as much. That's cheaper than a lot of scooters, Skip the ABS and you can knock 500 bucks off that price. Obviously a 250cc entry level sport bike will not appeal to everyone, but if you're looking to get a fast start to your motorcycle riding future, the 2012 Honda CBR250R is a fine choice. <laughs>